Protists are a group of mostly single-celled organisms, but some like giant kelp are large and multicellular. The strange thing about protists is that they are classified together mainly because they don't fit into the other categories of life. They're not animals, plants, fungi, or bacteria. They're like the odds and the ends category of living things. There are three types of protists. There's animal-like protists. These are often called protozoa. They eat food like animals do. An example is an amoeba, a tiny creature that moves by stretching out part of its body. There's plant-like protists. These are sometimes called algae. They make their food from sunlight, just like plants. An example is kelp which is a big brown plant-like organism that lives in the ocean. The giant kelp is one of the fastest growing organisms on the planet. It uses the abundant sunlight in its shallow water habitat along with nutrients in the water to grow at an astonishing rate, sometimes as much as two feet in a single day. There's also green algae, which are much smaller and found in habitat-like ponds. Lastly, there's fungus-like protists. These protists are decomposers, meaning they break down dead plants and animals like fungi do. An example is slime mold, which is often seen as a bright, slimy layer on old wood or in grassy areas. In summary, protists are a very diverse group of organisms that can act like animals, plants or fungi. They can be found in a variety of environments, from ocean water to freshwater ponds and even in soil or on decaying wood. This broad diversity is what makes the group of protists fascinating and unique. Don't forget to subscribe!